Hey guys, this is going to be a review of the Eli Beta Ball and Planter. So this is a 0.75 gun Beta Ball. So it is pretty small, so it's not even a gun. And it has, it has an LED light here. So I see it a bit better there. But during nighttime, it's actually pretty decent. Uh, this is actual glass. Of course, this is plastic. And then back here is where the planter would be. It comes with this gravel. And then in down here, if you overfill it with too much water, it has a uh, tray on the bottom to collect the water so it's not going all over the place. Which is pretty nice. And then it should also come with, which I don't have, is I bought my news, but it comes with a like a divider thing up here that you can put in here that lets it so lets it so you can have a planter with the actual plant in it and uh, some pencils and whatever else you want to put on the side there. So if it's so if it's on your desk or something, it makes it quite convenient. And then over here, well, I gotta say though, it does look kind of like a toilet bowl, which is kind of funny, at least from this angle. And back here, there is a micro USB cable, so you can plug it in, so your LEDs can work off of that. Or you can have it like I do, and it takes three AA batteries in here. So either way works. And it's supposed to have on the LED light a four hour internal... Uh, sorry, it's supposed to have a four hour internal timer on it so that's pretty cool so you can leave it on night time as like a night light and then it'll turn off for you after four hours now I will say this is a nice beta bowl but I again do not recommend having this as a permanent home for your beta especially when it's in cost I want to say it's around it's over 20 bucks new you can buy a decent tank, the actual tank for about 30-35 bucks for a beta, they'd be a lot better and a lot bigger. But I mean, I bought mine used from my, the pet store I work at for like 10 bucks, and I did just to do this review. So I'm actually going to be moving this beta into a 5 gallon tank pretty soon here. <clears throat> but for a temporary type deal, this is, it is nice. It just, I would spend the extra 10-15 bucks and get a bigger tank than this, or anything like this. I mean, you can see my beta there sort of doesn't want to focus in there but he's like a silver silvery colored really cool ground tail then it does come with the gravel or the uh, marbles glass marbles is actually what you call it in the plant there and like I said the actual gravel for back here as well so yeah, I would not recommend this for a permanent home but for a temporary home it is okay and yeah, well, that's, that's about all it is. I mean, it doesn't have a filter or anything, so you should be doing water changes quite a bit on this. I'd, I'd recommend it a couple of times a week at least. Because, I mean, that your poor bay is sitting and pooping, uneaten food and whatnot. And then also the air, or the, sorry, not the air, the water on top can get, like, a film on it. See, mine actually has a bunch of bubbles there. But, yep, so that's a review of the beta... Beta Bowl and Planter by Elive. Alright, thanks for watching guys and have yourselves a good one. Goodbye.